is text is a function that evaluates a value to see if it is text and accordingly returns a true or false. The isNumber function evaluates a value to see if it's a number and returns a true or false. These two functions are among the information group of functions in Excel. I am Nabil Murad. In this tutorial, I show you a nice tip for each one of these functions. So let's dive in. In column A, I have some values, text and numbers. I would like to find out the text, so I'll be using an isText function. So in cell B2, I type equal isText, and then I hit tab. I select the range from A2 down to A13. I close the bracket, and when I hit enter, whenever I have text, I get it true. Whenever I have a blank or a number, I get it false. I'm going to recreate this function in column C, but instead of using the isText function, I'll do it with an operator. So I type an equal sign. I select the same range from A2 to A13, and I say, is it greater than double quote, double quote? And when I hit enter, I get the same exact result. Then greater than double quote, double quote works exactly like the isText function. I also have conditional formatting in this range in which I used the isText function. And here is the conditional formatting rule that I created. I can use the isText function within a filter function to extract the text only. So I can type equal filter and then I hit tab. I select the range from A2 to A13. I type a comma and for the include argument, I type isText. And then I hit tab, I select the same range one more time, I close the bracket twice, and when I hit enter, I was able to extract all the text values. On another worksheet, I have the same exact values in column B, but this time I would like to extract the number. Then I'm going to use an isNumber function, equal isNumber, and then I hit tab, I select the range from B2 to B13, I close the bracket and hit enter, and whenever I have a number, I get it true. Whenever I have a text or a blank, I get it false. Instead of using the isNumber function, I'm going to use a comparison operator. So in cell D2, I type an equal sign. I select the same range one more time, but this time I say, is it less than double quote, double quote? I hit enter and I get the same exact result. I'm also using the is number for applying conditional formatting to this range, and here is the conditional formatting rule I'm using. I can use the is number to extract the numbers within a filter function. So I type equal filter, I hit tab, I select the range from B2 to B13, I type a comma, I just want the numbers, so I type is number, I select the same range, I close the bracket twice, and when I hit enter, I was able to extract the numbers. If you found value in this tutorial, give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to my channel to be notified when new tutorials are released. The best is yet to come. Thanks for watching and see you next time.